that was a, that was a game changer. Oh, B, what's going on? <laughs> so look, let me let me tell the world out there. We just finished up our second day of a two-day boss boot camp, 2019 Q1 boss boot camp. Just want to say congratulations to all all the new certified speakers and coaches out there, and we had a phenomenal time. I want to encourage the new graduates to go out there and kill the marketplace. Share your services, share what you've learned with the marketplace, and make sure that you build your business based on what you learn. So y'all, you know, just go out there and do that. And then also let me say, for all my speakers and coaches that are out there, you better come on in the boss, because we leveling up. Every quarter it gets better and better. I think next quarter I'm gonna call it Boss 2.0. <laughs> boss 2.0, the 2.0 edition. Y'all have a great grind day, we talk soon. How many of y'all have, have done more than one program? Yeah, you just program after program. Coaching program, and you gotta stop. It's not the program. The programs are great. They give you the information. You're lacking the effort. And I promise you, it kills me, because when I look at y'all, I get on the phone, I'm like, y'all tripping. And then I'm like, so I'm at the point now where I'm like, I'm, I'm only gonna meet people where they are. The business, you want clarity, you wanna find the audience, and you think it's just gonna come in the form of a written word. I'm living this life. And if you want this, you need to come live this life. But the question is how bad you want it. What inspired me originally was I was did, I did a lot of research on Boss, the program, and I started stalking some people that had taken the program. I saw some photos, I started matching up names, and I started hitting them up on like Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. And I was just asking a ton of questions because I was a little hesitant and skeptical because here we go again, another training program. But as they were telling me some nuggets and, and takeaways, tangible takeaways that helped them be successful in their business. And when I say successful, it doesn't just necessarily mean money, but they were being able to have a, a working uh, speaking business, I thought, okay, this might work. Also, I love the fact that he was a young brother. I saw the people that was in the program, sisters and brothers, that I thought was really awesome. And then just the clarity and realness that uh, his videos brought to me. I'm glad it was, it was one of the best investments, I will say, I won't lie. It was one of the best investments for my speaking career. Don't stand up in front of your audience sharing quotes and you're not living a certain life. So like, don't stand up and tell people, Alcohol is bad for you, but you drink. Like, so I tell people, I, I'm a cuss, I'm, this gonna happen. I'm telling you who I am up front, and I do it. So let's just be transparent in who we are. Tell them you was crazy, and every now and then you still crazy. You know what people love? They love real. They love authentic, organic. You, try, you start trying to be like somebody else because you looking at what other people do on their platform, and they look sweet. Lisa Nichols is sweet on her platform. Mel B is sweet on her platform. I'm sweet on my platform. And when you see me doing what I do, don't do what I do, do what you do. Boss has given me the confidence to stand up, the confidence to stand before people and tell my story. Boss has today helped me identify what I want to do in the future. Just being in a room full of people from all over the country that are meeting together for the first time had allowed me to shake the nerves, tell my story, and get phenomenal feedback and some, some pretty tough gut-wrenching feedback at that. Let me ask this question. More than anything, I want you to understand how that works. You got it? And did you uncover some things about your level of experience that means everything and see where you've been holding yourself back? Did, did you catch that? I want you to, to take hold of it. Now, don't think that you're just gonna go out there and be like, I charge 10,000. Based on your experience, you can, but you gotta have the intangibles that connect to it. Your little website need to look like it. It ain't gotta be fancy. It just gotta be a basic site that got a picture with that fire bio, and you might have to pay somebody to write your bio. It's okay, so take those experiences Experiences, get the logos, put them on there. All of the, the auditions that you got, I need to see that written. You really need to find somebody to write that bio and make it sound right. And then you need to read it and believe it. And then when you believe it, you walk in different. And it ain't got nothing to do with your audience. That's why I separated the client and the audience. It's two different things. Your client needs to know what your experience and your qualifications are to come and do this work and why I'm gonna pay you five or 10 grand. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. The more clients you work with, guess what? Your fee goes up. Because of what? Your experience. Boss was outstanding. It was a wonderful experience. Two day boot camp, it was it was intense, but it was definitely rewarding the last three months to get to these last two days. Like I said, it, it was definitely uh, a mind blowing experience. Everything that we learned that Kendall taught us from day one up to today all came together. And like I said, it, it was a great experience. 
One of the biggest takeaways from today is that I have a story that needs to be heard, that people want to hear, because too often have I been told the negative parts of don't tell your story, what goes on in our house stays in our house, but our story is something that everybody can, needs to hear and needs to listen to. I found out today that I can learn something from everybody's story and that somebody learned something from mine. If you're, if you're like me and you're a visualizer and you can see the vision of what you can do with your gift and earn money from doing your gift, what are you waiting for? You can't nickel and dime your way to that vision. You can't just find free videos and get your way to that vision. Like watch the free videos, listen to the free podcasts, but also make an investment in yourself.